Hey guys, it's Harry Styles Tether. So I've had a highly requested video uh, for like my cleaning routine. So I thought I would get started on trying to figure out how to do that. I think y'all wanted to see some stuff what I do too. So I may I'm gonna clean a lot tomorrow, so I may put in some stuff of what I'm cleaning. Um, first off, I was gonna show y'all, of course, Pinterest. Of course, you found different stuff with cleaning on there. But they have so many different cleaning routines. You can just look up cleaning routines, and there's like so many of these. Um, I just wanted to show you the one that I'm loving. I've actually, um, I have this printed off, and it's put up and everything, but it's kind of modified it just for me, so you can do that too also for you. Um, but this way you can clean, and you can not have to do it like all in one day, or all like, and you know, if you just do it all, this is like more spread out within the days and stuff. You should do it more like morning and night and then weekly and then swing day. So, but you, um, I do mostly do a lot on Mondays if I don't have time to do it because as y'all know, um, I work at my hair salon and I have somebody that comes and helps me clean at the hair salon. But yeah, yeah if I don't have like a whole lot of time to clean, then I, for sure, like, if the week is going by and stuff I haven't got to get done because I've been working a lot or getting home late or whatever, then, or don't have time, like, in the morning. Sometimes I've been getting up earlier because Kinsley is getting up earlier, so I actually may have, like, 30 minutes in the morning to get some stuff, more stuff done. Then I do it at night or feel like just going in and getting it done before our day gets started. Um, then I definitely take my Mondays to finish all my cleaning that I need to get done. So, and I actually, to be honest with y'all, I need to get back into the routine. I get out of the routine and we'll get so busy. The summer has been so hectic and it's just been crazy. But now that it's like calm down, it's fall time and all that. And I want to get back on the routine of everything. I like being on a routine. I like doing my, what we do, you know, get up, take kids to school, go to the salon, work, and come home and, you know, that kind of thing. So, to start off, then I have a couple other things I'm going to say. So, um, now the first one, daily morning, it says make beds. And truthfully, I don't think we hardly make the bed. I've heard that it's, it's really good to make your bed. You're more organized and all that. But, I don't know, we're not good on, I do, I get in the routine of doing it. And then, uh, and then I get in the routine of not doing it. So, I like, go back, we go back and forth about that. That's the first one, and this is wipe down bathroom counters, um, any counters really, I do, in the kitchen too, um, and then empty the dishwasher. That way, and honestly, we don't, we kind of eat out probably more than we should, so a lot of times this isn't, isn't an everyday thing for us. Um, we may only do this about three times a week, because if we eat out, then we don't have dishes to wash to do that, so that's that. And then like I said... I add more stuff in the morning that I can get done where, you know, if I want to go ahead and get it done and I'll, because I'll forget or not get it done. Then at night it says, um, load dishwasher, wipe down kitchen counters, take out the trash, um, quick sweep of, or vacuum, especially in the kitchen, um, spot clean the floor or Swiffer, uh, declutter living area like pick up um with pick up basket or mainly it's cleaning up like Kinsley's toys and stuff like that um and I really try to do that every night um and then chore of the day this is below and then that's the swing day thing that I'll tell you about in a minute and then weekly so like it has on Monday you want to vacuum Mondays are pretty much where I'm going to do a lot of this stuff to go ahead and get it out of the way or stuff I haven't gotten done the week before. Um, clean mirrors and windows on Tuesday, Wednesday, scrub the toilets and tubs. Um, I almost would, I almost do that one on Tuesday to remember to do scrubbing a toilet and tub Tuesday, you know, kind of rhymes. Uh, Thursday, mop the floors. Fra I feel like I usually do floors all at one time. I normally like to group stuff together, like do vacuum and mop at the same time. And 
I'll, t I'll show you the stuff that we have. We have like a, I'm not sure if it's called a Swiffer or whatnot. Um, and then swing day. And then a laundry on Saturday. It says, but I normally do laundries on Monday. And talking about laundry right now, every Monday I'll do laundry. And usually what I've been doing is I do all the la any laundry, blankets, sheets, like all of our clothes, like everything on a Monday. And then the next Monday, I usually will do just like one or two loads of whatever we like have to have washed. Because we don't have that many, like, because I like to um, organize it like whites, colors, nice clothes, dark clothes, towels. So that's five loads if you organize it like that. And we have baskets to organize it. I should go show you all that. I'll show you tomorrow when I clean. I'll try to remember to show that. Okay, let me show you this real quick. This is our hamper that we use to do like, I do whites, <coughs> colors, and then these are like our nicer shirts and stuff <coughs> like that. I see you. So that's what we do as far as um, putting our clothes up in a way. When I do that, there's smaller loads. So I don't need to do it every week. I, need, I do it every other week and it's a good bit and then you get it done. And then, so every other week, I'll just throw clothes together, whatever that needs to be washed. Or, you know, I just grab some out that I'm like, okay, she might wear this this week or whatever. So that's what I normally do. That way that I can do that. Um, to organize my clothes that way to wash. Swing days, um, it's just you do this like one day in the week randomly. Um, so wipe down all furniture and cabinets, scrub, oven, microwave, and fridge. And as you're cleaning the fridge, I would say you need to clean out the fridge. And when I do that, it's normally when we go grocery shopping, when I get home with the groceries. Before I put the groceries up, I clean out the fridge completely. Like, I just go ahead and clean it out. Because if I put more stuff in there, and there's stuff that needs to be taken out, thrown away, that's already old from that week or whatever. So, I normally go to the grocery store, like, once a week. So, sometimes even more. Because we drink a lot of milk. So, I always have to go a lot. Anyways, that's off topic. So, that's normally what I do. As far as that goes, um, wipe down all the walls, molding, and doors spot clean of poultry and rugs. So, that's that. That's like something you can just take a look at, you know, each day to look at and figure out what you need to do. But like I said, on Pinterest, there's a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton that you can look at and find what's right for you or you can fix it and print it out for yourself. So, a couple more things would be like when Kinsley has all her toys out here, like try to get your kids to play with one thing. Like if she out the blocks and they're like everywhere, then if she's done playing with that, try to get her to clean, get him or her to clean it up um, before she goes and grabs more toys. So there's just not toys like everywhere. Just kind of, if you get them in the routine of that, then they'll go ahead and do that. And a lot of times she's, uh, Kinsley's been really good with it because we're at the salon. She's toys at the salon and she's playing at the salon. I try to keep it very clean and stuff. And so... I try to get her, I'll say, clean up, clean up, of course, that, that song, everybody clean up, and I try to get her to be in that routine and helping me keep stuff clean at the salon, so she's kind of already kind of getting into that. So, like that, or like saying when you cook, instead of just cooking, eating, and then sitting down for the night, and then getting up after that, oh yeah, I forgot to clean the dishes, just like go ahead and clean, clean up right then before you're going to sit down to eat or whatever so you can just relax the rest of the night. We like to take things with you like normally when I've been sitting here on the couch watching TV or whatever and I get up to um like I'm going to go get ready to go you know get ready for bed I'll just go ahead and pick up a couple of things like if there's some cups sitting around or whatever just go ahead and pick them up and take them with you um to do that, like if you're going to go from one room to the other, normally there's at least something that you need to take with you. It's like ha being pretty organized, just being organized yourself, like having everything where it's supposed to be is like so great. If you can try to do that, I'm very, I'm one of the people that is very like, I hold on to stuff, but like sometimes you just have to rid of it or do something with it if you don't have a place for it and it's not organized 
then your, you know, your home's just never going to look that clean if, you know, you want to keep stuff organized and all that really good. And then, of course, like I said, Mondays I normally do my big cleaning on Mondays. Like, I try to get most of it done if I can while I have time, um, if I don't have anything else going on. And then other than that, I'd go by that little thing there. So, I hope this was helpful, guys. I'm going to try to put in some footage in here of different little organizing tips I have or cleaning tips and, like, showing you what I do and what I use and all that. So, yep. Okay, so this is to go along with my cleaning routine. Um, I've got a couple things here. This bucket of stuff, this little bag, and then this bag. Um, so, I'm going to clean this stuff out here to show y'all what I use. I see. Cool. A hammock. Great. So this little bag I take with me when I'm going to like clean really quickly. Normally I'd have like this in here too, but I took it out so I could show. Um, so for Breeze, of course. Um, then some Lysol, little disinfectant wipes. Um, I love these for like, um, these are the dry, what do you call them? They're the Mr. Clean Magic Erase bath scrubbers. I use that a lot on the sinks and the showers and the baths. Um, and they have the little bags so when I take the trash out in our little things. And then this. Um, so, and this is just the Oxy Surface Cleaner. And I also have one of these in here. The Windex Touch Up. So you just like press on it and it comes out. To clean stuff off real quickly. So that's what I take when I'm going to clean up something like pretty quickly. Just go over a couple things. So this is my other big bag that I take. When I'm going to do like a really deep clean. Like with the kitchen and bathrooms. Like everything. I just have everything in here. Um, more bathroom cleaner. More sprays. And all this. Just all my extra stuff here. Um, and disinfectant spray. And there's little baggies too and more wipes so just more extra stuff um and this too and this has all my scrubbers in it like um let's see that's for like wood and stuff um just my extra little scrubbers and this is our couch cleaner um just more of those and all and this one stays under the sink um and these go with our swiffer cleaner thingy it's actually at the farm right now, so I can't show you, but I'll put a picture here up of what these go with. But it works amazing to clean our floors, and I use it here and at the salon. Our washer and dryer for cleaning. Our vacuum cleaner that we love. So if you're looking for a new vacuum cleaner or anything, the Shark Rotator is really awesome. We still have the box here. <laughs> we got it not too long ago. But actually, it also can come apart and sit on this thing over here. But it really works really good. Um... Yeah, it's amazing. Just go ahead and show you what I use as far as dish detergent goes. Um, this is the Gain Island Fresh. It's my favorite um, detergent. And then softener. I just use like the Walmart brand. This is the um, organic clean kind. And I like it. And just um, shout I usually use. And then I use these pins if we have really deep stains like just need to get out. Tide booster is really awesome. I use that on our nice clean. And there's our dishwasher we need to clean. Pretty much it. Just some products I thought I'd show you that I use for cleaning wise. And these I have set up around like in our bathroom and stuff just to clean up real quickly a couple things. So, so thank y'all so much for watching. Stay tuned for more videos. Check us out on Pinterest, Facebook and all that. My website is And we'll see y'all for our next video. Have a great day. Bye.